Hi guys, welcome back to our channel and welcome back to another episode. Today, in this episode, this is quite exciting because let me show you guys. This is quite an exciting episode right here because we are going to harvest our first tomatoes. As you can see, we have turned really red. We are ready to harvest. There's not much, but that's great to see that we are able to harvest our first tomatoes. Let's get right into it and then I will show you a bit how, like a little update on how the net house is doing so far. Unfortunately, I don't have a basket, so I'm going to like put them in a plastic bag for now. Three little tomatoes so far and then I'm going to see look around if we can see like a few more I can see one here I'm not too sure if I want to like harvest it or let it ripen a bit more because it's so like reddish like orange like a mixture of orange and red orange and red so um probably let's let's harvest it let's see not yeah i think it's okay i let it ripen Sorry. we remove that so it doesn't poke into another tomato stay fresh there's another big one here as well which I'm going to harvest like it's a pretty big one this one I don't know if I will harvest it or let it ripe a bit more I think I will harvest it yeah let's harvest it as you can see it's a pretty big one You guys might wonder but what are these like white spot on my tomatoes these are like I put this fungicide to prevent powdery mildew when I spray on the leaf it has like got on the tomato as well but it doesn't affect like the tomato you don't have to worry about that guys just in case you are wondering so we better doing great all the coriander are growing perfectly here yeah, I had I had to resew uh, the carrot uh, plant because we have try out one day I was I was not at home and nobody came to like actually there was no one at home and we did not was not able to get someone to like water the small carrots plant that we have here and they dry out that's unfortunate but it's okay i i like resew some of them and as you can see they are slowly growing sprouting all of them i don't know if you guys can like notice these are carrots sprouting here and uh, this bok choy I had to resew most of it because if you remember last time there was there was a small snail which came and eat all of my bok choy which was quite unfortunate as for the watermelon I'm still waiting for them to sprout here and the strawberries are doing really well as you can see it's growing 
and for the I think it's white bees as well I have to wait them to grow but yeah so far everything is going fine already starting to harvest some tomatoes and that's great obviously it's the first few fruits we are not going to get a lot but I'm, I'm really excited it was I'm really excited for that because I know in the few in the near future we will have more more tomatoes and I will have to harvest some thyme as well to use in the kitchen but uh, before that let me show you not because on not because of only the tomatoes that it is a very exciting uh, video today because we are going to say before guys we'll have some new materials that I'm going to show you like new resources that I have invest in it's really an exciting video today because it marks the start of something new let me show you let me show you guys As you can see here, we have all this, how would I say, this bags of soy here, all of this of soy. You might say, what is so exciting about soy here? But, but guys, that's a really exciting update because these two containers that I have here, uh, just like the fish tank, is going I'm going to plant um, aubergine and uh, pepper in here, and I will. I'm excited to show to like to show you guys and to see as well myself how well we are going to do. As you can see, we are doing really nice. Yeah, the peppers are, are growing and the aubergine are doing really really nice. Tomatoes as well. But yeah guys, that's a really exciting uh, uh, news that I have to do. I will have to fill up the container with some soil. And uh, yeah, that will, be, that will be really interesting to see how much soil can affect the plant and uh, how much we can like increase the yield and just to will just be a fun part in, in general I, I like this this project and i will try my best like document everything and to bring you along around with me on this journey and to show you guys how much progress we have made so far and yeah guys that's a bit a short video for today but really really exciting one because we have resources that i'm really eager to use and we have harvest our first tomatoes as well and uh, yeah guys the seeds that i have been growing of germinating as well let, let me show you as well the potato plants which is doing really really nice as you can see potato plants are growing gorgeously they are doing really nice but yeah guys really really exciting episode for me today and uh, I'm so excited for all the new crops that we are going to be able to grow and uh, like experiment with here and uh, yeah that's I'm, I'm grateful actually I'm really really grateful for everything so far and everything is going like really well and it could be better but for someone who it's first time learning about farming and uh, agriculture I'm, I'm, I'm really having a lot of fun and I hope you guys enjoy me like documenting my progress as well I know it doesn't look perfect like the other former but i'm trying my best and i'm having a lot of fun doing this guys and i hope you guys are having fun as well watching these videos 
and uh, yeah that's a bit it for today I will end the video here and I will make sure to like when uh, I will tackle this uh, expansion this upgrade of this uh, project here I will uh, try to get some footage for you guys as much as possible and I will see you guys on the next video that's all for today thank you guys for watching and feel free to comment